Thanks, Vanessa. Yeah, let's definitely hope we get out of that. Uh, we make it out without not too much snow. We've got Gabe here today. Gabe Rockers from Edwards Jones, and we're going to talk about something that maybe we can control. We can't control the weather, but right. we control <clears throat> if we pay off debts or if we invest. That's the big topic for today. Yep. So no easy uh, answer to the question. I think you have to evaluate each situation first and foremost to determine is it better to tackle the debt first or to invest, or maybe we can kill two birds with one stone, as they say. All right. So let's tackle some of those. Okay. Ideas. So first, I'd say a few of the key points is one. Pay yourself first. If you're, like work, if you're working for an employer that provides a plan, a 401k, 403b, make sure you're putting money in there. And if they provide a match, put enough in there to get that free money. Good. So okay. fr free is me, as free I always is, said. Free is me. So I like that. That's I right. like that. So, Especially when it's uh, money. That's right. Uh, try to live within your means. Okay. You know, that's one real big key is if I can't afford that item, should I really pull out the, the plastic and swipe it? Because then inevitably what happens is you pay over face value for your item if you can't pay that credit card off each month. And something you should do, let's say if I really want to think about should I pay off my debt, what, what's the number one thing that we should do? So first evaluate your, uh, your cash situation. If you can't cash flow paying off the debt and investing, mm -hmm. you better tackle the debt. I typically like to look at the number if my debt cost is over five and a half percent, mm -hmm. I really want to look long and hard at paying that debt down first because I can't guarantee that as an investor I'm going to beat that number in the marketplace. Um, if you've got a mortgage debt, here that's a deductible interest on your taxes. Mm. So your after tax cost of that debt's not that expensive. So if your mortgage rate's reasonable, pay on your mortgage and work on your future retirement plan in, from an investing perspective. I definitely, so. so definitely a way to do both those things, but I like both of those involved, definitely looking at the situations. Yep. And if you need help doing that, what should you do? So anybody can always pick up the phone and uh, reach out to any of our local Edward Jones uh, associates or advisors. Uh, I'm down on the South Belt, down near the tractor supply in the Walmart. You can always walk in and we can schedule to sit down and understand what's going on in your situation. All right, thanks Gabe for coming into us.